Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we have got the system of equations. As you can see over here, a plus 1 divided by b plus 1 divided by c plus 1 divided by d equal to 87 divided by 38, where a, b, c, and d are our natural numbers. And now we are going to find the value of a times b times c times d divided by a plus b plus c plus d. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. We are going to think outside the box in order to solve this tricky problem. Therefore, we are going to be very creative. Instead of uh, taking care of the left hand side, we are going to proceed with the right hand side instead. Therefore, let's focus on this uh, fraction. And here I have copied it down. And now let's go ahead and perform the division 87 divided by 38 and we know that this is going to go twice so we're going to have a 76 and our remainder is going to be 11 so therefore this fraction could be written as 2 and 11 divided by 38 and now this uh, mixed number could also be written as 2 plus 11 divided by 38 doesn't make any difference whatsoever and now we are going to tweak this fraction 11 divided by 38 just keep in your mind that 11 divided by 38 could be written as 1 divided by 38 divided by 11 therefore this whole thing is going to become 2 plus 1 divided by 38 divided by 11 so therefore 87 divided by 38 could be written as 2 plus 1 divided by 38 divided by 11 and now let's go ahead and focus on this fraction 38 divided by 11 and now we are going to perform the division once again 38 divided by 11 and we know it's going to go three times we got 33 and our remainder is going to be 5 so therefore this could be written as as a mixed number 3 and 5 over 11 and this mixed number could also be written as 3 plus 5 divided by 11 and now let's focus on this 5 divided by 11 we can tweak this thing so 5 divided by 11 could be written as 1 divided by 11 divided by 5 so therefore this whole thing could be written as 3 plus 1 divided by 11 divided by 5. Now we can see this 38 divided by 11 has been uh, transformed into 3 plus uh, 1 divided by 11 divided by 5. So therefore I replace this part by this one as you can see over here. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this fraction 11 divided by 5. Let's go ahead and perform the division once again 11 divided by 5 2 goes over here so we got 10 our remainder is 1 so therefore this fraction could be written as 2 and 1 fifth which is a mixed number and we can also write this one as 2 plus 1 divided by 5 so therefore we can see that this 11 divided by 5 could be written as 2 plus 1 fifth so therefore I replace this 11 divided by 5 as 2 plus 1 fifth. So therefore 87 divided by 38 has been written into this uh, nested fraction. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and compare these two equations. This one and this one we can see that this 2 is our A. This 3 is our B this 2 is our C and this 5 is our D as you can see 
over here and by the way all of these numbers are our natural numbers and here's our final step let's go ahead and find the value of this uh, fraction by just plugging in a b c d value in this uh, expression let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in our case a is 2 let me write down 2 times b is 3 c is 2 d is 5 divided by a is 2 plus b is 3 c is 2 plus d is 5 let's go ahead and multiply out the numerators so this is going to give us 60 divided by 12 at the denominator if we simplify this thing that turns out to be 5 so thus our simplified answer turns out to be 5 thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye